the Scuttle Boys are gonna be so proud of me! They're gonna say, Solon, you're our favorite sailor! And then they're gonna make me the captain, and then I don't have to do what they say anymore, and they'll... What? No! No! Alright, all hands on deck! Everyone, we can do this! We gotta get a whole bunch of cannonballs! We don't have any cannonballs! It's fine, it's just a Kraken. You guys, if you guys get on, can... Some of you guys... You guys need to get on to the... Th you know what? Lazy. Insubordinate. If I were a better captain, I bet I bet I wouldn't be in this situation. There wouldn't just be a Kraken in front of me. Aww. This doesn't happen to other pirates. I know it doesn't. This is just a Solon thing. Just my sailor luck. Just keep moving. Remember what we said? Panicking is a sign of unpreparedness. Or something like that. Ah! It's like they're preparing something. Some kind of weird attack. Let me out! Let me out! Can we get out? Are we free? No! No way! Bye, Karen! You guys did great. You guys did great. All of you did. You guys are all the heroes today. Bye, Karen. I'll see you later. She's waving goodbye. Oh, I'm proud of you all. See? When you don't panic, it means you're prepared, and good things will come your way. Wow. Now the Scuttle Boys will have to make me captain. And to think, before I had all of these friends on my ship, I was so alone. But the moment I had these friends on my ship, everyone wanted to be my friend. It really shows the power of material goods. They say money can't buy you happiness, but they can buy you friends, and friends can buy you happiness. And is this even the... yeah, this is the right dock. This is the dang dickery dock that I want to be at. And that'll put all my friends into the nice little government foster care program that gives me money. That way we all win. They get to be with all their friends. And I get paid. Uh oh, is it storming out? That's probably not good. Hello, rich people. I've made so many friends today. I'm gonna show you all of my friends. Right, Mildred? Mildred's boss. She knows exactly what's going on. Hey, Herbert. Yeah, we love Herbert. This is a good place. And Herbert loves my chest. At least it can't get any worse. Whoa. You know what? Let's just, let's just, ow. Let's just anchor this down right here.
Oh, Olwen. Look at what I got for you. Yeah, I'm proud too. Anyway, I got more to give you. I'll see you later. Bye. Can you believe the weather we've been having lately? First loneliness. And then Krakens. Now it's a thunderstorm. That's crazy. Oh, but look at the sunrise. My mommy always called this weather rain shine. And rain shine brings rainbows. Or I guess it would bring rainbows, but not until the rain shine goes away. Then rainbows happen. Anyway, more friends? Look at this box. All right, the jump got really, really far, so we might have to go underwater a little bit. Don't be mad. I know you can't swim, but I'll hold you tight. What were you doing in here? I saw that. You're doing weird skull stuff, aren't you? Yeah, you freaky, Olwen. Alright, well, you have fun. Yeah, you have fun playing with your skulls, dog. Yeah, you rub that guy. She's way friendlier than with them than I am. Maybe I should stroke my skulls more often. Maybe they'd like that. Alright, it's just you. You and me. The loneliest two sea dogs to ever roam the sea. I almost want to take you with me. We could have our own adventures, ornate carafe. I could be... I could be the captain, and you could be my, my coxswain, or my wainwright, or my ship, my, my matey. You could be my first mate. What do you think about that? Oh, you probably want to be with your friends, huh? I can't argue with that. I want to be with my friends, too. But you know what, Carafe? We can't always get what we want. We can't always get what we want! Don't you ever turn on me. Never turn on me! Now you're stranded! You don't got legs or arms, and you didn't even help when I fought the Kraken. Yeah, you glow. Don't be like, don't, don't make me feel. No. No, ornate carafe. I'm gonna, I'm, I'll just leave. Can't, you can't manipulate me like this. I couldn't shoot you. I'll go take you with your friends. You can be with your friends and I'll just be alone again. Just another scuttle boy without his scuttle boys. Alright, Herbert. Here's the last one. I didn't keep any for myself. These are all for you. Just keep them safe, okay? Thanks, Herbert. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna go back to my boat now. Well, it was good seeing you guys again. Even though you almost never talked to me. And really just want me for my, my, my goods and services, but... We could, you know, hang out sometime. We could go on, on the boat. We can go somewhere good. Well, guess there's only one thing left to do. It's time to set off for sea. That'll make the Scuttle Boys really proud of me. And when they crown me captain of the ship for all the amazing adventures I've had, when they hear all we did today, they're gonna sing my praises to the moons. And maybe a star. If they can get that far out. 
think stars are farther out than moons. I think they're really far out compared to moons. This is my boat. These are my adventures, and that means there's only one thing left. Time to make this my scuttle. There we go. Zero out of one votes. Scuttle the ship. Oh, when they see me, the Scuttle Boys will be so proud of me. They'll go, oh, how great you are at captaining the sea. You fought off Karen and Captain Petey. And you didn't even have to take a break to go pee. And that's why they'll be so proud of me. That's a good boat right there. Oh! That was just me. Just me and all that remains. One chicken coop. 